Hi, my name is Max Hag and in this video you will get a review of Muse, the brain sensing headband. I've been practicing meditation for five years on a daily basis and used Muse for the past 30 days. And I also had a couple of friends starting their own meditation practice with Muse. So the main concept of Muse is that it teaches you how to meditate and how to establish a daily meditation practice. And there are thousands of studies on the benefits of meditation. I won't go into them here now. What I found most interesting about Muse is that you can use it to conduct your own experiments on flow, on altered states and on different types of meditation. Muse works like this. This is the Muse headband. It's got five sensors in the front and two in the back behind your ears. Your brain is constantly sending out brain waves from so-called alpha to beta, theta and gamma brain waves. The seven sensors in the Muse headband measure your brain waves constantly. You can adjust the size of the headband to your head and I must say it fits quite well for my big head and it's also very lightweight. You open the Muse app on your phone, put in your headset and choose a soundscape, an exercise and a duration for how long you want to meditate. The soundscapes is kind of like a level, like it determines what you hear. So there's a beach, a rainforest, a park or my favorite, a desert. And there are different exercises you can do and you can hear. There are exercises for beginner that just start to teach you meditation right from the beginning. And once you start a session, the headband connects via Bluetooth with your phone. The app starts a calibration, so it tries to find out what's the current state of your mind. And if you choose an exercise, you will get a short introduction of how to meditate, like one or two minutes long, and then it goes into the actual session. You're ready. Close your eyes, find a comfortable position, and allow your back to be straight. Take a moment to notice that you are breathing. Now here comes the main concept of Muse. Instant biofeedback. So when your brain is active, you will hear the weather in the soundscape get louder. So for example, let's say you are in the park. It means you will hear like stormy clouds. You will hear children playing in the background. You will start hearing a construction site and noises in the background. Then this feedback is a, is a sign that tells you, hey, like, watch your breath, like, look what's going on in your mind. And you can consciously calm down your mind, for example, by watching your breath. And then you will hear the weather is getting nicer, the noise is getting away, and it's becoming like a very nice day in the park that you hear. And when you're calm for longer periods of time, you actually hear birds that are singing. After your session is over, you can see a visual overview of your session and how your brain was active during different parts of the session. The app has built-in gamifications with points, levels and challenges to keep you going and establish a daily meditation habit. So here's what I think about the Muse and what I heard from the other people using it. Um, I think it's great for people who are new to meditation, who want to learn meditation and for the people who want to establish a daily practice because the gamification keeps you going. The biofeedback can help you to calm your mind down but it can also do the opposite. For advanced practitioners it can be a bit weird that the whole app is focused on one type of meditation, on meditating with closed eyes and watching your breath so that's the only way um, they teach you in the app but you can still use other types of meditation and that uh, worked for me as well as watching the breath the whole biofeedback definitely works so you can consciously um, change it with your mind you can consciously influence the sounds of the weather and the brain waves and what i found really cool is that you can use it to measure yourself after sports, while meditating, while listening to specific music, uh, maybe after having a coffee and you can just see how different substances and activities can change your brainwaves and I think that's 
pretty interesting, um, especially for all people who are optimizing their flow. So this was my review. Let me know in the comments down below why do you want to get a Muse, why do you want to get an EEG headband, uh, what's your plan with that. And if you want to see more neurotech reviews, hit subscribe.